Hi, I'm David Merle with Coldwell Banker Capital Gateway and I want to talk about adding value to your home and specifically today I wanted to address pools. Uh, a, a typical pool is going to start at $20,000 and easily run up to $30,000 and if you're getting a nicer pool, fifty dollars or $60,000 is easy to spend and I just got a quote on doing a pool in my backyard with all the whistles and bells and they wanted $120,000 for putting in a pool. Uh, so those are some of the costs of, of, of putting in a pool, but it, there's also ongoing maintenance costs on, on a pool. You can easily add uh, one and two hundred dollars a month to your electricity bill for running the pump. Uh, some people try to save money by adding uh, a solar heater uh, to, to their pool, so uh, pumping the the water up onto their roof into a solar array and then heating the water there. What my customers have found with those is the cost of, of driving the, the water up to their roof with a, this pump uh, is as much as running gas to, to heat their pool anyway. So I'm, I'm finding people actually taking those components out of their, their uh, uh, system after they've spent all the money to install it. Um, and uh, so there's there's heating costs to the pool and there's chemicals too. Uh, a typical maintenance in a pool in this area to pay a pool person is $60 a month. And I understand that if you do it on your own, that the chemicals are going to run you almost $60 a month anyway. So you might as well pay someone to do that. And then it's a, up around $120 a month to have someone maintain the chemicals as well as cleaning your pool for you on a monthly basis. So those are all the costs associated with a pool. Uh, and does it add value to the house? The answer is yes, it does add value, but unfortunately not as much as you spent on the pool. Uh, even if you get a, a pretty entry level pool with no frills at twenty or thirty thousand dollars, you only added ten and at a maximum twenty thousand dollars in value to your house. So uh, 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 the exception, of course, is, is if you're in a, in a nice affluent neighborhood where everybody has a pool, there is an expectation that you will have a pool and your value will be dinged pretty significantly if you don't have a pool. But um, most neighborhoods in California, a pool is a luxury and uh, you only get ten dollars or $20,000 in value for having a pool. So there's a scoop on pools. If you have any further questions, call me. I'm David Merle with Coldwell Banker Capital Gateway. Thank you.